In this video, I'm going to show you how to easily change the color of a logo if all you have to work with is the PNG file. So I had a client that asked me to add this women owned business logo to a flyer. The flyer that they had was very dark, almost black, and obviously this black text would not show up on it. So what we need to do is change this black text to white. Now, unfortunately, we don't have the original logo file, so we can't just go in and change the text color, and we don't have an SVG or vector file available to change either. But we can still make this PNG work. So for this logo in particular, I want to keep this O with these colors in it, but I want to change all of the black to white. The first thing that we are going to do is duplicate our layer. So you can right click, and select duplicate layer. We'll click OK. Now we're going to take one of our selection tools and we will select around all of our black text. Perfect, except I see that I clipped the edge of this circle here. So I'm going to hold down Option and this will subtract from our selection. I'll give it a little bit more room around that circle. And now we are going to create a color overlay effect. To do this, go to the effects button at the bottom of your layers panel and then select color overlay. From here, this is already on white and this is what we want, but if you wanted to change the color to something else, you would click this color swatch and then you can make a selection just like you would in any other scenario. I'm going to click OK. And then we are going to select around all of the text part and we are going to leave that O symbol unselected. Now we're going to create a layer mask so that we keep the white only on these letters. To do that, click this circle inside of the rectangle at the bottom of your layers panel. And that brings back our colored circle that's on the layer underneath. So this is almost there, but as you can see, there is a very slight grayish line that we have coming through from our bottom layer. So we are going to basically create the inverse mask on that layer. So I'm going to select our bottom layer. I'm then going to select just around our O symbol. And then we can create a layer mask again. Now you would save this as a PNG. When we paste this into a new file, Even if we have a black background, it's now going to show up exactly how we wanted it to be. So that is how you easily change the color of a logo in Photoshop when all you have to work with is the PNG. If this tutorial was helpful, be sure to subscribe for more Photoshop tutorials, and I'll see you guys in the next video.